So good morning everyone, mabuhay. So we are the group 1 and we will be discussing about the stakeholders and the key players of cruise industry. So let's move on first with the group members. So as for me, I'm Alana Faith Almonte, followed by Angel May Campo, Thea Noreen Intrada, and lastly, Ethel K. Nepamusino. So let's proceed. So for the, as for the cruise industry, it really involves a wide range of stakeholders and key players who contributed to its operations, the growth, and even the success. So these stakeholders and key players include the first one will be the cruise line. So as for the cruise lines, they are the core of the industry. Of course, kanang if we like cruise line, so wala tayong matawag na cruise industry, right? And also, they they provide the ships, the cruise, and even the services to passengers. And some of the major cruise lines include Carnival Corporation, Royal Caribbean Group, Norwegian Cruise Line Holdings, and MSC Cruises. So as for the group, no, we chose the two major or the largest cruise company, cruise line companies. So for the first one, we chose the Carnival Corporation and PLC. So on Carnival Corpor Corporation and PLC, it is a global cruise company and one of the largest vacation companies in the world. And it is also a British-American cruise operator with a combined fleet over a 90 vessels. So, ang sa ganin ang fleet, gani? So, ang fleet, meaning sa fleet, kay muna siya ang group of ships sailing together or under the same ownership. So, ang Car Carnival Corporation na asyay ka ng 90 vessels, which means the ships, and also, nasa siya 9 cruise line brands. So, with the 9 cruise line brands, over tanan, overall, tanan, na total is 90 vessels. So, ano siya, guys. And also, noto kuan jud sa history of the carnival, ug unsa jud kanang foundation sa company, of course, or actually, ang Carnival Corporation and PLC kanang didn't come into existence before, not until in the year 1994. So actually, the first jud nga usa na buo ang Carnival Corporation, kay ang first jud nga nakuan kay ang Carnival Cruise Line. So, ang Carnival Cruise Line, Jude, mauna siya ang first, and it was founded by the entrepreneur Ted Arison. And, ang kaning Carnival Cruise Line before, kay part siya sa Boston-based American International Travel Service, or EITS. So, meaning, kaning Carnival Cruise Line ship, kay under pa siya sa Osaka Company, no? And eventually, kanang gipalit daw ni, ni Ted Arison ang Carnival Cruise Line for one dollar. So, imagine nga uh, gipalit ni Arison ang Carnival Cruise Line for one dollar. And eventually, mauna, karon mo na pinaka largest and biggest koan cruise ships no company pero di ba ni palit gipalit ni Arison ang Carnival Cruise Line before for one dollar but na siya utang sa AITS or the American International Travel Service Company na siya utang a five million so ano siya ni bayad siya one dollar but na pa siya utang a utang a five million but eventually kanang ang Carnival Cruise Line it achieved its position as the world's most popular cruise line. And the company began expanding through acquisition. So, mando siya. Eventually, na, marag ni, na naghanas siya. So, marag siya ang nine kabuok niya nga 
brands. So, mano siya ang, that, that includes the Carnival Cruise Line, no? The Holland American Line, the Seabourn, the Princess Cruises, the Connard, the AIDA or AIDA Cruises, Costa, the P&O Cruises in UK, the P&O Cruises in Australia. So, tumauni sila ang subsidiaries nga mauni siya ang nakapa kanang buo sa Carnival Corporation and PLC. So, of course, uh, for the subsidiaries of Carnival Corporation PLC, we also choose one o- one only no, to discuss with you. So, that, that will be the um, Carnival Cruise Line. So, of course, this is Mojinisha ang foundation nga nung nahimo ang Carnival Corporation and PLC. So, ang Carnival Cruise Line ilaha ang kanijung ko ansha kay if this company or this ship identifies their target customers as do as those who like to choose fun and live life to the fullest so man siya no kita mo sa logo nga fun for all and all for fun one for all all for one diba so Ang Carnival Cruise Line, daghan ni siya o vessel. So, namili sa mi o duha ka buok. Since, actually, ang kaning mga ship nga mo ang na-choose kay mag ilaha mga ship kay na siya type of mafit gani siya sa usakap mga passengers. Like, for example, kani Carnival Sunrise. Ang Carnival Sunrise, no, kay maudo ni siya ang best ship for singles. Kaya nga no, kaning carnival, usually, kanang dilis, wa kay dyan sila ni adapt og solo cabins. Meaning that no ships in its fleet offer accommodations for one. So, love, di ba? Of course, mukha dyan ta kanang, makabayad dyan ta kanang, kanang state robe for double occupancy. So, if ever man gani na kay kakuan, di ba, wata kay baw, no, makakuan day kag, kinang partner ni mo, kalit-kalit lang. Of course, makatunga ka <laughs> sa bayranan. Pero, kidding aside, kanang, ang kuan jud aning carnival sunrise kay, all state rooms are designed for double occupancy. So, it's generally a rule that a person traveling alone must pay both fares or for the, for the whole state room na jud. So, this means they will pay twice as much per person as two people sharing a room. So, mauna siya. Also, this ship is best for so loco, no? Carnival cruiser who want to balance finding an expensive vessel with choosing one that sails short itinerary. So, mauna siya, guys. Nga nung best for kuan siya singles, kay ang kuan daw, kanang, ang kaninga ship, kay mo sailor ni siya for short itineraries, just like four to five days, or kanang, mga gamay ra, ang adoon nila nga, kuan stop, so mo siya, like, and also, very affordable ra sa siya, compared to the other, kanang, ship, so, and also, if ganahan gani ang, kanang solo traveler, or solo cruiser, no, to be, to be in a, kanang, more livelier, um, kanang affordable and even and also kanang kanang sh- short itinerary stra, so carnival sunrise will be the best cruise ship for them so so ang kanisang carnival sunrise kay nanis la ilahang kanang signature which is ang serenity adult only retreat sun deck so no for ang kanisya nga kuan kay for adults so dyan siya, no kids allowed so best for single sad siya no mafit sad siya for single kay maadto ka dito at kay ba maka maka kanang kamit ka sa emo ang kuan sa so, emong cupcake sugar plum char so mauna siya guys uh, tungod lang sa jud ani nga kuan ilang signature nga kuan which is ang serenity adult only retreat no mauna siya ang kanang Best sad daw for single. So, as in the picture, mo ni siya ang serenity adult only retreat or for the place. So, 
if your goal is to mingle, you can potentially meet other solo cruisers. So, go na guys. Get the chance na pagtigom na mo for Carnival Sunrise. So, next kanang cruise ship in Carnival Cruise Line will be the Carnival Horizon. So, on Carnival Horizon, it is best ship for luxury luxury lovers. So, ano siya? Or, kani, Havana Cabana Suite. So, if you are, example, if you are married or kanang bago lang mo nakasal or basta, oi kanang partner mo, or basta partner mo, niya mo, kuan mo, ane, Havana Cabana Suite. So, no, it is really perfect for for the lovers. So, kay nga naman, nga naman perfect siya for the lovers. It's because, kani siya nga sweet, kay, kay, kana ganing, kay, kani jud siya nga koan, kanang inspired, is for, kanang, it jud siya for lovers. It's because, kanang, naamoy inyuhang koan, private lounging area with your own deck chairs and hammock. Plus, also, no, Kanang, ang kaninga sweet kay you can have your exclusive Havana pool no na may access sa Havana pool nga exclusively for all of the kanang ni purchase or ni kuan og Havana cabana suite so no and also pa jud guys ang kani pa jud if mo purchase pa jud mo ang Havana cabana state room or suite kay very kanang important person gani mo nila kay priority jud mo nila in check in and also in boarding priority sad mo nila for dining room so na amo inyo hang kuan dedicated state room attendant no hang state room attendant diba so shall kayo and also guys priority sad mo for debarkation at home port and also for from debarkation and disembarkation, no? Kanang kwaon mo nila with water shuttle or anything, ah, ma kuan mo nila kanang mag-guide o makuan, makuha. So, next, kanang cruise ship in Carnival Cruise Line will be the Carnival Horizon. So, on Carnival Horizon, it is best ship for luxury, luxury lovers. So, ano siya? Or, kani, Havana Cabana Suite. So, if you are, example, if you are married, or, kanang bago lang mo nakasal, or, basta, oi, kanang partner mo, or, basta, partner mo, niya mo, kuan mo, ane, Havana Cabana Suite. So, no, it is really perfect for, for the lovers. So, kay nga naman, nga naman perfect siya for the lovers. It's because, kani siya nga sweet, kay, kay, kana ganing, kay, kani jud siya nga koan, kanang inspired, is for, kanang, it jud siya for lovers. It's because, kanang, naamoy inyuhang koan, private lounging area with your own deck chairs and hammock. Plus, also, no, Kanang, ang kaninga sweet kay you can have your exclusive Havana pool, no? Na may access sa Havana pool na exclusively for all of the kanang ni purchase or ni kuan og Havana cabana suite. So, no? And also pa jud, guys, ang kani pa jud, if mo purchase pa jud mo ang Havana cabana state room or suite kay very kanang important person gani mo nila kay priority jud mo nila in check in and also in boarding priority sad mo nila for dining room so naamo inyo hang kuan dedicated state room attendant no hang state room attendant diba so shall kayo and also guys priority sad mo for debarkation at home port and also for from debarkation and disembarkation, no? Kanang kwaon mo nila with water shuttle or anything, ah, ma kuan mo nila kanang mag-guide o makuan, makuha. So, the next will be the, the largest, also one of the largest and the most 
famous cruise liner um, company in the whole world would be the Royal Caribbean Group. No, I'm Royal Caribbean Group, guys. Kay same Richard Sha is a Carnival Corporation PLC. No, kanang dilinis la mahimo if wala just like gisugdan jud no sa first. So di mahimo ang Royal Caribbean Group if wala jud siya nagsugod sa Royal Caribbean Cruises. So actually nagsugod siya sa Royal Caribbean Cruises. Kaning Royal Caribbean Group, okay, or formerly known as Royal Caribbean Cruises, it is a global cruise holding company incorporated in Liberia and based in Miami, Miami, Florida. Sorry. So as I said that this kanang company, it is the world's second largest cruise line operator after the Carnival Corporation and PLC. So, as what I also said that dili ni mahimo ang Royal Caribbean Group if not because of what sila nagsugod sa Royal Caribbean Cruises. So, actually, uh, in 1968, no, a hospitality entrepreneur, Ed Stefan, and the three Norwegian ship owners, which are Sigurd Skalgen, Anders Wilhelmsen, and Gotas Larsen, created a cruise line to sail the Caribbean. Caribbean no? So, mag-cruise sila, or to, ay sail sila to the Caribbean. And also, the partners chose the name Royal Caribbean. It's because with the connection to royalty signifying the high standards of service guests could expect for the company. So, mana siya, guys. Nga, nga nung na-form ang Royal Caribbean Cruises. No, sail sila to the Caribbean mainly. And Royal Caribbean, it's because with the connection to the royalty, it means if royalty, of course, high standards, no? So, next will be Monisha Ang, the, these are the subsidiaries of Royal Caribbean Group, which include, of course, the Royal Caribbean International, Celebrity Cruises, Silver Sea Cruises, Azamara Cruises, TOI Cruises or True Cruises, Hapagloy Cruises. So, next, he choose the three largest ships of Caribbean cruise liners. So, the first one will be the Harmony of the Seas. So, ang Harmony of the Seas, guys, mauni siya, no? Before, in 2016, siya ang pinaka-largest, no, among all of the ships in the Kuan, Royal Caribbean. But, eventually, kanang na na surpass siya sa yung sister, which is ang Symphony of the Seas. But, ang Harmony of the Seas, in 2018, kanang, na-awardan siya as the best cruise ship na built siya in 2016, and na-awardan siya pagka 2018 as the best cruise ship. And as of now, she is the third largest passenger ship in the world. Kaning Harmony of the Seas has 2,747 state rooms of various sizes to accommodate up until 2,747 guests, up, up to 5,479. So, I will be um, providing some videos about the Harmony of the Seas. So, please, kanang watch mo guys. So, mag-provide rin mi Amura Ipo sa G-Class, no? Uh, Naka-indicate sa to dito ang mga names sa kuan para di mo maglisod ang pangita. So, next will be the Symphony of the Seas. So, mawin siya, guys, ang Symphony of the Seas. So, she was built in 2018. No, imagine, ang Harmony of the Seas kay na-awardan lang siya ato, but naghimo na sa sila o bago, which is ang Symphony of the Seas. So, ang kanin Symphony of the sea, Seas, kay she can accommodate um, 5,518 passengers up to a maximum capacity of 6,680 passengers. So, she was the largest cruise ship, no? At that time, kanang iya jung gisur pa si yung sister, which is ang Harmony of the Seas, no? So, guys, naagya pun ko yung ma-provide niyo a video, and also a vlog, no? Sa mga gikan TikTok, na makita dyan ninyo on sa iso, dyan sa Symphony of the Seas and Harmony of the Seas. So, the last one will be Wonder of the Seas, no? She was built last year, year 2022. And as of now, she was the largest cruise ship in the world. And this ship accommodates to Koana, to 7,000 
maximum passengers. You can see man siya dako jud siya kaysa sa duha no sa Symphony of the Seas and the kanang Harmony of the Seas. So guys, I can provide again a video jud guys no. Unsa kada ka Wonder of the Seas and also the amenities inside the ship. So my provider me amo ra sa G class. So another stakeholder of a cruise industry is cruise passengers. So passengers are at the heart of the cruise industry. They pay for cruise vacations and expect high quality services, amenities and experiences. And of course their preferences and feedback drive the industry's decision or also the success. So unsa may tawag gani sa kanang mga passengers who go on the cruise ship. Okay, ba ba mo guys? Ako na siya na-mention ganina. So, ang tawag na nila, di ba, kay cruisers. So, kanang, while in the, kanang, you're in the cruise ship, no, you, you'll have to find out the types of people, no, you'll find on a cruise. So, the first one will be the thrill seekers. So, ang thrill seekers, kaya mawin sila ang mga eager dude na discover all exciting activities na Risky job ka ah, you guys. Like, ma-involved yun ang physical risk. So, mawin siya ang thrill seekers. So, ang usa, kay example anin no, kay, kanang kuan, kanang mag-deep. Example, ilang itinerary kay, na uh, sa kanang Caribbean. So, of course, mawin na sila mag-deep water diving dito. Or kundi, kanang, kung sila mag- mag zipline sila sa pinaka world's deepest zipline in Maarten. Mag inana sila, niya mag- Helicopter tour, something na na kaya risky gani ka yu. Or kundi mo, ato sila glaciers tour. Or explore sa sa glacier. Ang glacier guys, kaya mo ni siya ang kanang, kato kaya yung, kaya yung murag sa ice age nga, nag-form siya o big ice. Na kinana gani. So, mo kinana na explore sila. So, very risky dito sila guys. Pero, kani sila, mo ni sila, mo ni sila, tawag sila like thrill seekers. Kaya eager dito sila ma-discover. Exciting activities. So, the next one will be the lifelong long learners. Ang lifelong learners, of course, they love to build up their knowledge and skills. So, mawag rin na sila, guys. Ang lifelong learners, ganaan dyan sila masigig toon or makakat on, no? So, ang example lang ni, if ilang cruise, cruise ship, kay mer cruise, or musail to Alaska, so, mawag ganaan sila nga ma, matudluan on how to kanang dog sled and also fish for crabs. If mo ado sila Mexico, kay Example, mul, mul, ganaan sila mo learn og salsa in dancing or even in kanaganing onboard activities where, where in, they are in the cruise, no? Kay, pwede na po, ganaan ganaan dyan sila mo kuhan o ganaan cooking demonstration, something na na niya. Mag-cut on dito sa art exhibition. So, manas lang guys, ang lifelong learners. And next will be followed by history buffs. Ang history buffs, guy, kay, guys, kay mo niya siya ang um, from the word history, of course, they love to learn a, a vast well of historical knowledge. So, mara gana sila, guys. Musik sila o cruises, no, or cruise ship nga kanang ang mga itineraries kay kanang with, kanang naasya, mga rich with cultural kanang background, something in anak nga lugar. So, ganaan sila ginana. So, next will be the shopping enthusiasts. So, ang shopping enthusiasts, no, masabutabur in ninyo. So for the for the word sh- for the word shopping, so of course, ganon is like shopping. Magcruise sila for shopping only. Magtus lang line line lang lugar just for shopping. Actually, guys, for cruise ship, mang good guys. Bisag nara ka kanang jun ang kanin jung cruise ship kay sa usa ka example for eleven days. Dag kanam good mong magdo or mas tapan nga lugar good. So ano siya na kanin dut so maguro ang uban ani mukuha ng cruise ship, kay, gana, kay lahi-lahi ba yan, so, makapalit yun sila, ni example, gana, kuhan kay ka, kanang gastudera kay ka, o, oh, perfect kayo nyo, so, cruisers love to bring home, also, kaning mga shopping enthusiasts, no, gana, dyan sila, mag bring home memories from their favorite adventures, mo na sila, guys, and next, followed also by world explorer, explorers, so, ang kanin sila nga, mga cruisers, kay gana, dyan sila, travel, Explore the world, creating lasting memories, and share the experiences with their friends and family. So, traveling to multiple ports of a culturally excites the world explorer. So, kanif, 
fit jud ni nila sa kan ay ma fit jud ni sa world explorers ang cruise ship no labi na bisag asa lang maabot or bisag asa lang a port example so mga pangdato sa ni sila guys so next will be the travel agency ibo nam jud ta ni yung sa jay kanang role ani niya sa tourism industry very crucial jud siya guys very important to kay ni siya nga kuan factor or sector sa kanang kuan tourism industry especially also to cruise industry of course because they help passengers book cruises or even book an hotel or anything guys no to ar- just to arrange itineraries and provide valuable information no kay ba nam jud ta ang travel agents mo ni sila ang maka help gani sa passengers or the clients nga smooth ra jud ang ilahang kanang vacation like wala sila hon na naon so daghan daghan man kayo og travel agency around the world but nako ay nakita nga travel agency kanang sa Philippines which it is called as kanang Raxo Travel so mani siya Raxo Travel guys so ang kaning Raxo Travel it is one of the Philippines major travel agency no kita ko ani mag na kanang kita ko nga ko siya accredited genisha nga uh, akre oh as Araxo Travel as an accredited member of Ayata and it was also a full fledged travel agency providing for foreign domestic enterprises and having six branches at key locations in the Philippines so guys kita mo ng website website link tira you can also click that but unfortunately masindot jud to siya sa personal tanaw kay mag ako ni i-click niya ako ni i-show niyo guys but unfortunately kanang dili man so kanang kindly if you want to know jud about the Raxo travel you can kanang see jud um sa jud siya okay kita jud guaning Raxo travel they have mustap nai mustap diri nga cruise liners which is on Norwegian line no mustap siya diri sa Philippines ato siya dito sa Manila first then next will be the bu- in ato sa Boracay yan next day ato na sa silang Palawan yan next ato na sa silang sa Taiwan yan sunod sa Japan i think Japan i i mean i think Japan then Taiwan something ina na ilang itineraries no nindot kaayo imagine no Karon pa ko nga na jud ay cruise ship nga maanhi diri nga mukuan jud ang Philippines. No very kanang proud. So next will be the another stakeholders and key players of the cruise industry is the port authority. So it kani sila guys very essential jud siya kanang sa cruise industry because ang asa madunggo ang cruise ship at tumun jud ani nila no nya. Of course, kaning mga authorities or staff or employees support kay sila jud ang manage sa cruise terminals, sa security, sa custom, immigration, and other logistics for ships to embark and disembark passengers. Sila, sila jud ang manage ani tanan guys sa port. And also, ang port, ang port authorities, they are also the one to regulate and control navigation within the limits and the approaches to the port. They also disseminate nautical and other relevant information to ships and all other info parties. And lastly, to control maritime transport and loading and discharging of dangerous goods. So, eventually, ang meaning jud ang port authorities kay Moro jud ni sila ang manage jud sa port. No? Yung manage for everything. So, muna siya guys. So, let's proceed to the other stakeholders and key players. Of the cruise industry. Next is the destination partners. Cruise lines work with destinations and local tour operators to provide shore excursions and experiences at each port of call. Partners include ports of call, tour operators, tourism boards, port facilities, environmental considerations, marketing and promotion, and safety and security. The relationship between cruise lines and their destination partners is mutually beneficial. Cruise lines provide an influx of tourists to these destinations, boosting their local economies 
while passengers get to enjoy diverse and exciting travel experiences at each port of call. Um, for example, the port of Barcelona, Spain. As we all know, Barcelona is a significant Mediterranean cruel destination. Crew lines partner with Barcelona to offer passengers access to Gaudi's architectural wonders, the historic Gothic Carter, and the vibrant local food scene, and also local tour operators provide city tours, tapas tasting, and more. Next is the shipbuilders and manufacturers, companies that design build and supply cruise ships as well as equipment and technology for onboard operations are crucial to the industry. Prominent shipbuilders include companies like Carnival Corporation and Royal Caribbean Group. Shipbuilders are responsible for designing and constructing ships adhering to safety standards and regulations. They contribute to the maritime industry and national economies. While manufacturers produce marine equipment, components, and provide maintenance services for ships. They drive innovation and play a vital role in maintaining vessel efficiency and safety. If you have time, kindly watch the video link I provided in order to understand more about shipbuilders and manufacturers. Next is the crew and staff. Cruise ships employ thousands of crew members including officers, hospitality staff, entertainers, and more to ensure the smooth operation of the ship and a pleasant experience for passengers. Crew and staff on a cruise ship encompass two main categories, the operational crew and the hospitality and service staff. The operational crew, these professionals ensure the ship's safety and functionality. So, mauna siya ang mga captain, um, deck and engine officers, and security personnel and medical staff. While the hospitality and service staff, it focuses on passenger comfort and experience with roles like stewards, wait staff, housekeeping, entertainment crew, and guest services. Together, they work to make the crew enjoyable, safe, and memorable for passengers. Next is the regulatory agencies. Various international and national agencies oversee safety, environmental compliance, and health regulations in the crew industry. Agencies include International Maritime Organization, or the IMO. It will set global standards for the safety and security of shipping as well as environmental regulations for cruise ships. Next is the United States Coast Guard. It will enforce safety, security, and environmental regulations for cruise ships operating in U.S. waters. And last, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. It is to protect public health and safety through the control and prevention of diseases, injuries, and disabilities. It plays a crucial role in monitoring and responding to health threats, conducting research, and providing health information. These agencies work together to ensure that cruise ships operate safely, securely, and in an environmentally responsible manner. The specific regulations and oversight can vary depending on the cruise ship's location, flag state, and routes it takes. Industry associations. Associations like the Cruise Lines International Associations, or the CLIA, advocate for the interests of cruise lines, help set industry standards, and provide support and resources to its members. So, kani siyang uh, associations within an industry, so sila mo provide all the voice for the individual. And also, support companies and employers of a particular type of industry and protect their rights. For example, is the Cruise Lines International Association, um, who merged with the International Council of Cruise Lines in 2006, forming an expanded organization incorporating the existing functions of both organizations. So, the merged organization, which uses the CLIA name, is located in the Washington, D.C. So, mauna siya ang CLIA. 
So again, CLIA supports policies and practices that foster a safe, secure, healthy, and sustainable cruise ship environment, and it's dedicated to promoting the cruise travel experience. In addition, CLIA Day is the world's largest cruise industry trade association, providing a unified voice and leading authority of the global cruise community. So the following here are these are the some example of the um, national and international cruise line associations. Travel insurance companies. So travel insurance providers offer coverage to protect passengers from unforeseen circumstances and emergencies during their cruise vacations. So the risk range may it be from minor inconvenience such as missed airlines connections and delayed luggage all the way to um, more serious issues including injuries or major illness. So the main purpose there is to provide financial protection if um if you face certain problem when you are traveling there. So add to cover the insurance. Ano mga inano? So ano nasa? Importante yun din travel insurance, especially if mag travel, di ba? Okay, di ko taka tagaan sa panahon, di ba? Maka afford gan mo travel. How much more travel insurance? Ano sa dimo? Safety first ba? For example, there yung alliance. So known man yung alliance, may kadungo gumami everywhere, di ba? So Alliance DI is a German multinational financial services company headquarters in Munich, Germany. Its core businesses are insurance and asset management. The company is one of the world's largest insurers and financial services groups. It is a component of the Eurostox 50 stock market index. It is a component of a Eurostox 50 stock market index. So many examples and offer of um, travel insurance, so Alliance. But dili lang kay travel insurance na ano share kanong kain property and casualty casualty insurance, life and health insurance, credit insurance, and asset management services providers. So these include companies that supply the cruise industry with everything from food and beverages to entertainment and technology services. So daghan mga itag kanong mga service providers sa cruise lines sa bisag asang aspect may it be um water, um food, mga amenities kanong mga entertainment, inter internet, everything that gives service to the customers. So, sa kataghan niya, wala ko naghatag diri o example sa ubos na. Okay, this is na kaysa. Sa una to, kasi na provide kung you will sa cruise, kasi ka provide food, mga kung ang mga appliances, isa tag kayo, di ba? So, ganita na nag-google ha, gahayin lang tag-search. Tinabang ngayon, natin nagpita. <laughs> So next, ang environmental organizations, environmental groups monitor and advocate for sustainability and responsible practices within the cruise industry. So in every cruise line, not just the environmental responsibility, of course, to protect our environment, our oceans, the marine life, the air, everything. For example, no, managing solid waste, like waste management equipment, minimizing the use of plastics, sorting and separating the recycle. You know, how to properly dispose food waste, mga hazardous waste management, mga inana. So, usa sa niya sa pinaka-importante ang mga environmental groups. So, dili lang kay sila ang responsible, ano ha? Kita, as a individual, it is our duty to protect and improve our environment, di ba? So, sila lang ang mag-monitor. Kana siyang uh, organization in a specific cruise line. Investors and shareholders. Cruise lines are often publicly traded companies, so investors and shareholders have a stake in the industry's performance and profitability. The primary stakeholder of cruise tourism is a cruise passenger. The traveler is the one who chooses to become a cruise passenger and which itinerary to sail. The cruise passenger also makes several purchasing decisions for goods and services within the destination even prior to their embarkation to a cruise. In the case of a fly and cruise, passengers are brought to home ports by air travel and may need a hotel accommodation prior to embarkation. So this is often packaged with a cruise itinerary, turnaround destinations, inventories of airports, hotels, and ground transportation are involved in moving passengers to 
and from the ship so of course that is generating more income for it turn around ports than way ports in the middle of the itineraries the most important players in the cruise tourism are the destinations themselves and their local communities which host the cruise passenger and provide the experiences that are being in a way promised to the visitors so several types of entities play a role in the cruise tourism at the destination level including the cruise terminal government agencies involved in arrival and departure of international visitors the um, shore excursion operators host communities heritage sites and the local attraction or activities and of course the suppliers of the cruise ships while in port um, here are some largest public companies in the world. Carnival Corporation, which holds Carnival Cruise Line, Holland America, Princess Cruise, and Costa. The Royal Caribbean Cruises, which owns the Royal Caribbean, of course, and the Celebrity. Norwegian Cruise Line Holdings, which owns Norwegian Oceana and Regent Seven Seas. Travel and Tourism Authorities. The government tourism boards and organizations work to promote tourism destination and collaborate with cruise lines to attract more cruise ships to their ports. So what I'll be naming are some travel agencies. So first, the traditional brick and mortar agencies. Liberty Travel, a well-known travel agency with physical location that offer a wide range of travel services, including cruise vacations. Online traveling agencies, Expedia, an online platform that allows users to search book various travel options, including cruise, flights, hotels, and more. Travelocity, another popular online travel agency that offers comprehensive travel booking services including cruise packages. A cruise only agencies, the Cruise One, a franchise network of travel agencies specializing exclusively in cruise vacations offering personalized service and expertise. The luxury travel agency, Vertuzo, in what a network of luxury travel agency that provide personalized travel planning including luxury cruise experience so the niche and specialized agencies adventures by disney offers family friendly adventures cruises and tours catering to families looking for a unique vacation experiences the AMA Waterways specializes in river cruises providing a range of European and exotic river cruise itineraries. The host agencies Avoya Travel, a host agency that provides support and resources to independent travel agents helping them sell cruise and other travel agencies. Next would be the Cruise Line Direct Booking. A Royal Caribbean International offers direct booking through their website, allowing customers to explore and book their cruises online. The Corporate Travel Agencies, American Express Global Business Travel, provides corporate travel management services, including arranging corporate events and incentive cruises. Next would be the online marketplaces and aggregators. The Cruise Critic, an online platform that offers cruise reviews, forums, and deals, helping users research and book their cruise vacations. The Cruise Compete allows users to compare cruise prices and receive quotes from multiple cruise agents to various cruise lines next the membership clubs 
This will be the cost code travel. Offers exclusive deals and benefits to Costco members for various travel services, including cruises. This examples highlight the diversity of travel agency within the cruise ships industry, catering to different preferences, interests, and types of travelers. Each type of agency offers unique services and expertise to assist travelers in planning their ideal cruise vacation. The media and marketing agencies. So media outlets, marketing firms, and public relations companies play a role in promoting cruise lines and shaping public perception of the industry. So here is a video of a princess cruise example for cruise media and marketing. Our biggest objective overall at Princess Cruises within the marketing department is really to drive demand. And in particular, a lot of our focus is trying to drive new to cruise or first time cruisers. On one fold, it's category education. And the second fold is really getting them to our brand. One of our key challenges is there's so much data out there and we have a lot of different teams that all want to use data but aren't used to coming together and working collaboratively. There's a lot of things that go into making a DMP successful but really it's the teamwork, it's the collaboration. You really need all hands on deck. You need the IT resources, you need your CRM team, you need a great media agency that has that technical capability to bring it all together so that you can activate on all the different use cases and really see results. Every unique individual that we try to reach in this planet has a unique ad that will work best for them. We are going to move towards more specific audience targeting, more individual communications, more individual storytelling. You know who your customers are through the DMP and you're able to target specific messages, be more personalized, have more uh, dynamic, creative, and be more efficient. If you look at cruising, one of the challenges we have, since most people haven't cruised, is really to show them the different experiences that they can have. Really, we have this duty to create the best itineraries, best shore excursions, and really best onboard experiences so our guests have a great time. The data management platform really harnesses the data that allows us to customize the experiences. So you need to start with the data. We first were looking at a DMP because we were thinking of it from the media side of things. There's a great way to get savings there, uh, whether it's through suppression, reaching new audiences, lookalikes, uh, frequency caps. We realized there was so much more opportunity if we could connect it with other uh, marketing areas, with our web team, with our email teams. It's very important to set a strong digital foundation so that uh, you can take advantage of this long-term investment and really make the most of it. I think the greatest asset that Adobe has is the fact that everything's linked together. It makes it seamless. So you have that one universal ID across all the different platforms. It's one team, which is really great. When you think about personalization and things that we're partnering at with partners like Adobe, whether you're doing email, website, digital, social, I think we have this unique opportunity to have all these platforms work together because it is the same guest who's going back and forth across all of these touch points. That's a whole area that I hope you can help. It's a really exciting time for everybody right now in marketing. So the cruise prioritize audience education in this video from the Princess Cruises. So the marketing team goes into detail about how they think about targeting their primary customer base. So first time cruisers for Princess Cruises. Cruise ships marketing is all about teaching people how to cruise and why they should do it. So that means creating content around itinerary, planning, cruise benefits, and what to expect, they do this by using targeted communication that appeal to people on an individual level.